Aye. What's this? A rifle? You there! Stay! Where you are? How can that be? It makes no sound. Thanks for the present, Buster Washington. This is a strange surprise. Not quite what I was expecting. Now I must find Washington and interrogate him.
to get to Washington first. Then I'll worry about the artifacts. Who knows? All I've been told is that this is Lawrence Washington. Isn't he a rich man? He got himself involved in politics, no? Are you sure you shouldn't be in bed? I am fine, George. Be a good host for my sake. Go to the wine cellar and get something special for our guests. I will. Gentlemen. <coughs> my brother is a bright spot in a troubled land. If I may make one request before I depart this life, please leave him in peace. He should have nothing to do with the troubles of the Templar cause. We all respect that sentiment, sir. You have my thanks, gentlemen. Master Smith, are you ready to leave on your voyage? Aye, sir. I shall return with answers. Master Wardrop, are you likewise engaged with the manuscript? Yes, sir. We will soon know its meaning. Then I bid you take your leave. <laughs> Washington can barely stand on his own two feet. Better be right about him, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying man. 
George is quite the wrong fella, is he not? Oh, do not get your hopes up. He has eyes only for Sally Fairfax. That hussy! What if her husband hussy? George is the one sending her be a dude. Oh! Those loud noises give me a fright. Barely stand on his own two feet. Better be right about him, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying man. George is quite the wrong fella, is he not? Oh, do not get your hopes up. He has eyes only for Sally Fairfax. That hussy! What if her husband finds out? Hussy? George is the one sending her be a do. Last night. What about? I was wearing a nice frock and dancing in a posh cafe in Paris. I never it thought I'd see such a spectacle in my life. I had the most extraordinary dream last night. What about? I was wearing a nice frock and dancing in a posh cafe in Paris. It was magical. Ever fancied someone? You know you shouldn't. Got your eye on someone, have you? Washington, are you sure you wouldn't like to retire for the evening? No. I should put in an appearance. This is no plan. <laughs> you are too late, assassin. It's never too late to ruin Templar plans, Master Washington. <coughs> But my plans are already in motion. Even leading you here... <coughs> ...has given my allies time to escape. <coughs> Thank you... ...for making my end a quick one. And thank you... ...for revealing your master plan... ...you scheming snake. Damn it. I'd better hurry. Nice I have to get to the Morgan. Liam, I hope you brought the ship around. <laughs> Is that a ship, Mort? That's not Spartan! I won't let you pass. Right away. 
to the wind. Oh, sweet mm. bit. Lawrence Washington is dead. You look disappointed. The sickly way that man looked. He would have been dead in a month anyway. And two other Templars got away. They're looking into the manuscript and box. Did they have the artifacts? I don't know. Perhaps. I can't be sure. Then you did what was right by the Brotherhood. You'll find the object later. Cheer up, Shane. It's a rare day we could sow such chaos among the Templars. Perhaps. But to hear Washington speak, it didn't sound like they'd be too put out by the loss. Well, that's what he'd want you to think. 